Hi everyone, let's learn how to do a reverse canvas. You just can use any canvas that you can find at any store and we're going to start by just cutting off the canvas. You can use an X-Acto knife, you can run straight along the edge or you can do like I'm doing here and just cutting around the staple. I am going to speed this up for you because you don't need to see me doing all this, but we're going to just keep cutting in fast motion. If I was only this quick, right? Okay, so now that we have the canvas unattached from the frame, we're going to pull it off and you're going to be able to flip it over on the right side and let me show you how the frame is going to go now. See how that looks like a real frame? And um, you can just trim up the edges of the canvas. Um, this is why I said you could just run an X-Acto knife along a straight edge, but I kind of like to do it this way because then there's a little bit of something to grab on each staple, which I'll show you in just a second. So now you've got it all trimmed up. It's just a flat, nice, clean edge. And here is the back side of the frame. And so here's what I was mentioning about now you've got something to grab to pull off each of those staples because I just like it to have a clean cut. And now there's just that little bit that you can grab a hold of. Then the next step is to either paint or stain your frame. You can do whatever you like. You could paint it a color, paint it white or cream. What I'm doing here is I'm actually using antique wax to uh, make it look like it's stained. And this is just something you can buy at a crafting store and you can either use um, a wood tint or you can use uh, a dark antique wax like I'm doing here. So we'll speed this process up too and get this done lickety split. You can also use a swab to get into the little areas. Then on your canvas piece, here's where we're going to do our chalk couture. You can paint this canvas piece ahead of time. You can do all sorts of things, but uh, the point of the tutorial is to show you how to do a reverse canvas. So I'm just going to quickly uh, do this have courage and be kind in a navy color on the bare white canvas and then we'll pull that up dry it and then we'll attach it to the frame you may need to trim it a little bit more so that it's not overlapping the edge and then you're just going to take a staple gun and staple that back down pull it taunt on each side I like to do um, each side pulled before I, I put all the extras, but then just staple it down and you're going to have a finished frame that looks really cool, but is the inexpensive cost of a canvas. So here you go. Ta-da!